Welcome to Snippets Code. In today's video, we're about to embark on a creative journey into web development by designing a stacked menu using HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. In this tutorial, we'll explore a unique and visually engaging way to present a website menu. Imagine each page of your site stacking over one another seamlessly when the menu is opened, creating an immersive and interactive menu experience. With HTML and CSS, we'll handle the menu toggling, while JavaScript will step in to smoothly switch between pages. Join me as we delve into the intricacies of creating a stacked menu, adding that extra layer of creativity to your web projects. If you find this tutorial valuable then smash that like button and subscribe to channel for more exciting content. Create a checkbox input that helps to target all its below elements and toggle the menu. Also create a label for the toggle with close icon inside. Next create page element and provide ID for the element to make it easily targeted while styling. Also create another label inside page for the toggle which acts as a menu open switch. Set the height and width of menu to the entire screen. Style the page, set the height and width of the page to the entire screen.
set position absolute to the page element to move the element to top of the screen. Style the toggle button too also same as toggle button. Make the content element flex grow 1 to occupy the entire available space. Now let's make the menu toggle functionality. When the toggle input is checked target the page element and translate it to bottom right. Apply smooth transition for the page. When the toggle is checked, target the toggle button inside the head element of a page and hide it. Similarly move the title to the left when toggle is checked. Finally hide the content when the toggle is checked.
Now after animating the page element add some more pages to the menu. Similar to page 1 translate the other pages also. Change the background and text color for the other pages. Menu toggling part is completed. Now we need to create the functionality for switching between the pages. Target all the pages using JavaScript. For each page, listen to the click event. When the page is clicked, check whether the toggle is checked, that is whether menu is open or not. When the menu is open, iterate over the pages starting from the next sibling of the page that is clicked to last page and move those page to the left by 100 view width. Now once the pages are moved to the left set the toggle off. We can see that, when menu is opened again the pages are still at left 100 view width, change it by setting a default left 0 when menu is opened. Make sure to mention important in CSS so that it can override the JavaScript. Now we can see an error that the pages are staying at left 100 view width when toggle is unchecked, so make sure to reset the positions inside the JavaScript function. 